Colour has been a topic of fascination for the thinking human mind for over 2,500 years. The quest to pinpoint the boundary between the physical and the psychological has confounded philosophers and artists through the ages. It is on these boundaries that colour experience interweaves in an enigmatic and intimate way. Colour is a peculiarly difficult phenomenon to understand. In its purest form, as in these paintings, it has many phenomenological and metaphysical attributes. Dan McCarthy's colour works are an exploration of this mystery. My specialty in more recent times has become large format paintings, but that is very deliberate as well because you have to be you have to get people intimately involved with your painting. Something small just wouldn't work for work like this. The title of his exhibition, Yes's Knife to Nose's Wound is a reference to Samuel Beckett's Nose Knife, Collected Shorter Prose, 1945-67. The reference between title and work has associations to Dan's very difficult lifelong struggle with health issues, and he feels the struggle with these dark elements finds the necessary expression in his works. Dan has found some sanctuary in the creation of these magnificent paintings. Dealing with colour and, and paint and the creative side of things, I found, to my joy, a tremendous emotional connection between colour and drawing and creativity. And that, kind of, that led me on then, by, by extension, it led me on to, to the study of philosophy. Part of the excitement and intrigue of these works will be that the lone observer will find their own private beholder's share, as the historian Gombrich called it. Dan McCarthy hopes that visitors to his exhibition will come to know colour in its mysterious and metaphysical form and perhaps experience another dimension in colour. There is no form or structure in, in my paintings. They are simply colour. And the, the hope is that they would prompt people to get into their own private share, you know, the beholder share, and take it from there. <laughs>